Hey guys, what's going on? It's your boy Sim Gamer, and I'm back with some more Might and Magic Elemental Guardians. All right, I know it's been like what six days since the last video, but I wanted to bring you the next in the series of the Unlikely Heroes. And for those that don't know what the Unlikely Heroes is, it's basically those uh, units that fall under the radar because most people try to get like uh, the meta units, definitely four stars. But there are also other units that you could use if you're just not getting lucky and getting those specific ones that you want to get. And one that people might be overlooking is this Snake Fly. Now, for those that's having a hard time in PvP, this might be a better alternative, even even than that Fire Witch I showed y'all in the other Unlikely Heroes series. Now, the problem I was having with the Fire Witch is even though you mute them. You still have some characters, uh, I think like the Fire, the Necromancer, no, or the Faceless, one of them. Uh, they still, on their first skill, have a chance of uh, doing an AoE uh, and uh, frighten, uh, frighten your, your opponent's uh, lower turn bar. It's still chances, it's still weird things like that, so it's better if you can stun them or freeze them or uh, petrify them. And now this is what the Snake Fly does. He has an AoE petrify. Uh, all but the one he attacks. So if you look, attacks the enemy and drains their AP for two turns. Drain is 60% of their own attack, then turns all other enemies to stone for one turn. This is a very useful skill. And then you can follow up after that, you can confuse uh, one of their, say they have a fire diva, you know, she's really a problem for her. And like any, any unit that's really a problem, you can confuse them for two turns. So that means they have a 50% chance of doing what they would have did to you to themselves okay so not only can they petrify them for the first turn but it can mess up their their best unit for the second skill and it also does a lot of damage because if you have uh, attackers with you you could get uh, another ally to attack with you to do some good damage all right i haven't awakened this unit yet um i literally just started using them in the arena and it's been working off working paying off so uh let's go ahead and show them in the arena oh well, well, first, I wanted to make them fast as possible, so I have all haste glyphs on them, okay? 161 is still not that fast, all right, where I'm at. I'm in uh, Silver 2 right now, I believe. All right, Silver 1, I was fine with my fire, uh, my fire wits, but as soon as I got to Silver 2, I was losing so much. I had to find another unit, and this one now, I'm actually winning at a better rate. I'm still not winning every time, because they're still units faster than me, okay? So uh, I think 180s I will be better, but I'll see. I'm trying to farm up to get those. So basically, I just anything for speed, speed and accuracy. That's all I get for. <clears throat> all right, so I got the right. I'm at position 24 right now. Uh, I just fell. I was at 11. Okay, so overnight I fell to 24. So I, that means I have to make my defense. I have to make her faster. Uh, I'm sure she's getting out there because she's actually even slower, slower than my uh, my snake block. All right, let's get into it. This is a very interesting team. All right, this see this guy right here. This the uh, the fire necromancer I believe he is called is the problem. Okay. They're all a problem. This whole team is a problem. But we're going to see if we can outspeed them and kill them before they could do anything to us, okay? So, first things first, I got to bring in my two attackers. Where is my snake fly? All right, so my snake fly and then an the AoE guard breaker. Now I switched, I brought Kappa in instead because he has a more reliable guard break than my um, my uh, Priestess, my Earth Priestess. All right, so here we go. We're gonna see if we're faster. Hopefully, okay, he has a really good defense. He's about oh, around my level, level 76, I'm a level 81. So I hope, hope, hope I go up. I don't wanna fall underneath this guy. 
They have a good team. But we want to see if we can beat their team. Please, no immunity. All right. So, let's hope Snake Fly land at Petrify. Good. All right. So, all three were petrified. Now, we're going to land our guard break. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Pet the guard break did not land on everybody. This is not good. This might. All right. I don't know what this space is about to do at all. We're gonna try to confuse this guy and it's not working. Okay. Let's weaken his attack power. We've gotta kill him. We've gotta kill him. Oh my God, they are tanky. Madness, okay. Kill, 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 kill. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. I'm just gonna do my regular attack on him. All right, now we all we have left is this guy who seems to be blocking Okay, he'll block. All right, it doesn't seem like he's a big damage dealer, but we're missing a lot of attacks on him. All right, come on, three of us are attacking, we can't miss. Okay, there we go, 10,000 third. About time we crit on him. We're still missing a lot of attacks. This is why he's still alive, but it's all good. As you see, this team can work. Oh, once again. Oh my gosh, this guy is this faceless. Oh my gosh. <gasps> oh no, don't you miss. Don't you miss this. I'm not about to die. Okay. Wow. These four stars, man. Like, wow. Okay. Any other team I brought in, I would have definitely had lost to that team. Okay, so. This is that uh, that snake fly, as you can see, is very good. All right, we'll skip this one. Okay, so this team is potentially very dangerous. Definitely, uh, they they might outspeed me, but we're gonna try it out. Okay, let's go. That fire succubus might be super fast. I'm really hoping she's not. I hope I'm faster than her. Oh, the fire, it didn't, it did. man, okay. Let's see if we can still make this happen. Oh, we can't still make it happen. Elemental advantage, attack power buff, like retarded, this is retarded. Oh. We still got a chance here. We still got a chance. I still got my big time attacker. Let's weaken her attack. And let's confuse this one. Oh, we didn't land a confuse. The, the resistance is up. Come on. Yeah, get rid of all of that. Okay, good. We got her. We got her. There we go. All right, so I maxed out all of my air samurai skills. So he was able to land that crit because his crit's only a 70 something. But he did land that crit that time. So as long as he does crit with that guard break, he does a lot of damage. All right, so we won that one. Didn't look good. It, it didn't look good, even though we did get out um, sped right there. All right, here we go. So this is another speed unit here. This one's always faster than me. I don't know if I want to do this team, but we're going to try it for the video. But the snake fly gives you a chance to take out any enemy before they can start putting on all those crazy buffs. All right. Please outspeed this one. Please outspeed it. Okay, we did. All right. We finally outsped that one. Please petrify. All right. You see the petrify landed. Perfect. All right, we just need the guard break now. Okay, it landed. Now all we need is two crits and it's over. Okay, we didn't so much crit too much on that one, but can we crit? Oh, still not good enough. Okay. Take that one out. Take this one out. 
And now all we got left is one unit. This is still a dangerous unit though because you can't mute the whole team. All right, we do have attack down on him, so I don't know. Okay, there we go. So that's my um, that's the team with snake flies, looking very very solid, uh, very good unit to have. Um, so we'll go so you so oh look, I got the rank thirteen right now. Oh, so we got two more. We got two more for ten streak, but we're just gonna go check out how. I glyphed this guy real quick. But I took all my glyphs off my fire. My fire uh, witch. Which I showed y'all last time. So if you have a fire witch, it's still very usable. But I think this snake flies is more reliable. For what I want to do with my arena offense. Okay, so you see I got, I got speed, speed. I just put this here because it had speed substat. That's all I want. I just want all the speed I can get. This one had a speed substat, so I used it. Uh, I wanted the accuracy and it had speed substat, which is a good thing. I wanted another accuracy here, um, but it doesn't have. It, it didn't have the speed. It had speed plus two, and I need more speed, so I just used this one because it has plus four speed. But as soon as I can find accuracy that has uh, more than plus four speed, I'm gonna replace this one. But I just want to try to get him in the 180s as uh, soon as possible and get his accuracy all the way up. It's only at 39%. So I feel way more comfortable if his accuracy is higher because I have a higher chance of landing this. Okay. So that's, this is the key <laughs> to winning in the arena if you have a clean team, a yellow team like me. You want to just uh, guard break everybody and then just nuke the rest of the team. Alright, so hopefully today's video was helpful for you guys. If you do have a snake fly, don't just give them away. Don't just sell them. Uh, keep them. Uh, definitely if you're having a hard time in the arena. Uh, even if you're in a lower arena. It's like, like definitely in a lower arena. Actually, this guy will help you out a lot. I know he looks very weak. Um, I could evolve him. I believe. Yeah, not, it won't take too much to evolve him, but... I don't think he looks as good like this. <laughs> but that's that's Snake Fly, guys. Hopefully you like it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Until next time, this is your boy, Sim Gamer. And I'm out of here, guys. Peace.